people. Well, it's they don't really have that many good targets to engage on, to be honest, in the draft in general. Witch Doctor is probably the main one. But yeah. I, even if you kill him, he's their five positions. Oh, other you really don't want to open on. Oh, oh here we go. Now this. things are going to get interesting real quickly. XZ walks in. He did not get off the spell. They quickly drop the card and it connects on for the best who hits everyone. They try to turn this no garter going and he gets best again. He can't fight his way out of it. Now it's aggressive. Trying to hold his guard. They got off the tombstone though. This could be the big one that turns it. Again, the bash is Shiki getting smacked around like a ragdoll. And the two hero shackle from air. What a fantastic initiation or follow up, I should say. Aggressive. He heads to the south. Shiki getting still lobbed around. First, he's bashed. Now, aggressive arm with Tongli may actually survive this. Not sure if Shiki will be so lucky. The charge comes through. Another bash as a result of that charge. Maybe it gets the team wipe. He saw his ages. Remember, Tongli made it for this one. They're trying their best. Call down's going to be there. It's a very nice location. Onto the two. DC, though, ready with the Requiem. Going to off. That's big damage. Monkeys, though, in trouble. Gets saved with the shallow grave. Now they're looking to turn back on the Ziska. They burst him down in time. Chen pulling out the heel. The wall goes down. And Complexi now looking to finish what they had started from previous. Obviously, and now we'll have to see TC back on the second oh. line. He is annihilated with the stolen Requiem. Are you kidding me, Fly? And coming back to find it for the time being. Old boys, they take the tier three, and now they're going to go up to high ground and start to chip away at the racks. No reaction so far from Ryan Jones. He started just letting him go. They're still not trying to start holding him back, and now the fight will kick off. Joe probably for the BKB. Starts to hit away on Zedix. Bingo Static Sonic being dropped as well. Very nice to the side of all boys. This is a double kill for Joe as he's taken down both Phoenix Assassin and the Huskar. There'll be a glimpse bringing TA close and personal with Joe. And there's your black hole. On to two. He's cancelled though, but it doesn't matter. It's already a double kill for Joe again. Three heroes down on one Joe. Now with the disruption, setting up the kill on TDR. It's an ultra kill for your Gyrocopter. Can he find the rampage? It's only ZinQ. Are oh, they going to let Joe do it? He's heading straight for it. He was going to set back to Oh, he's 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 What a nice, what a nice guy. They got trouble from Viper. Turns around. U9 is really, really low, however. Witch Doctor coming in with the restoration. How has it come? He does have enough damage to kill off the Dark Seal. He's going to lose his own life here. He's going to go directly into Death Lord, which he's going to. Got a one, two, three. All on the bottom lane. There were only two isolated here, and he had the Death Ward. I feel like if not today, if we can move this fight, and they've got the numbers advantage. Mrs. Poe is getting a shackles off. That's a huge oh wrecking ball. And it's huge raise as well to follow. Mercy Queen is getting quite low as well. Requiem of Souls on top, and the two still doesn't even do anything. And now they know that Mercy Queen is up there. And we're smashed with the blind race, catching him out. That's going to be four heroes down. And Oh no, they just got it revealed oh, the, the timing rocket. for this. e hug probably feels oh. pretty confident, but the smoke's gonna come. They gotta go fast though, this rush is dying very quickly. And yeah, they probably don't expect this timing, but the power shot's gonna land, and they're starting to walk in as he just gets popped. Jaw goes down in quick affair right now, and Justin's left behind right now in those cogs. Great job by Boba. They're just going to go for this Roshan, but the BKB is just trying to get a little bit low. Who's going to pick up this Aegis right now? As the CM will flies in. Oh, I don't want to damage it. The Aegis is actually still on the floor right now. Is no, nobody's able to pick it up right now. MJW going to go down as well. Oh, and the no. cheese and an Aegis go the way of Mal's is to function in a similar fashion. Beyond pressing in. There's the surge forward from Gunner. He gets off the back. It's a really nice one. C deck starting to clean up. Putting it down. Rubik down, but the corner are surviving the ball. Oh, what a echo! It's the Lance Shaker again! Three heroes and the DK as well! It's a team wipe! What do you want to see from C deck in, in game three? So, oh, oh, that thought. That's oh, a hug right. on the four heroes! Oh, TK, you magician! Now the Shadow Fade sees opportunity. He's gonna wreck me up Spirit Bomb Q out of this world. The trap comes out. Then an excellent overgrowth, holding three more heroes in position. E-Home are just beating the ever-living crap out of C Deck. And then every single person oh, on their oh, team lines up for and this is a pressure. He's also eating the moonshots. It's good. Yeah, yeah, so did the Juggernaut. Oh, did he? Yeah, he did indeed. Yeah, they uh, both had a bit of a match. The Vimex is going out for the Jarrah Cops. They're going to go for the game, man. Oh, they want to finish this. Yeah, but the Tier 4s are already dead in Wheel of Space. They already blitzed. Oh, what? Oh, it's a base race, boys! It's a base race! It's going to be really close. Oh, oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Okay, oh, I think Boy Boys lose. Yeah, they lose. They just yeah. got stunned. You can see the Dire Angel's health here. It's not going down nearly as much as the Radius. I think it's a Oh, that's a laser! 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 Oh, that's a laser
they don't see into the pit until the Treant walks in. So now the vision is there for Alliance, and there's going to be a bigger wave of Treants coming in. The call down over on Mad. He's the most exposed one, but Roshan killed by the tire. Rota got in, he snatches egg. He actually grabs the egg of the more loud ones than Tinkers, and you've lost your two danger cores. The cross will be off target with the Orchid Trap with the Sprout. They'll do the work, and Alliance now is a fight they wanted. Trixie will be pulled back in, and it is a team wipe. Of the crowd with Death going for Winter. Get slow, but now four. I'm in trouble. Oh, man, get done. Dunk. Sunday vacuum wall follow up, and he gets a turnaround. Gets two, make it three. More about his team dealing the damage, whereas Wyvern has to support himself and really dish out the damage all stages of the game. Here we go. And he goes straight in there with the dream clone. Wolf from the BKB trying to fight for it all. First BKB on the Shadow Phoenix. Well, he's trying to turn a punch against the Tiny, but it's just not working out. He'll turn his head towards Snaker. Snaker will get low here. Will he die? He's going to have the positive burn charges. And he's going to be able to keep himself alive. And he gets himself out of this fight. And we are going to see the boss kind of left behind with Fennec, but it doesn't matter. Fennec will be able to bring down the Shadow Phoenix, but they do lose the boss. They will lose Fennec as well. It's a triple kill for the Lesh Rack amongst all of this action. Denzi. And, uh, you know, of course, Zaneka, the only ones to stay alive beside Na'Vi, and uh, the clock work and the left remain for LC. They head back into the pit, they might not have finished this one off, but Denti, he's going to be ready to go for a little bit of a play here, maybe see if he can get himself to steal. It will be risky. This is a very, very important moment. Denti has done this so many he's times in the past. So They're going to Bloodseeker. He's got oh, the bash! The bash onto Dendi! He has no snake and rules to be able to get the phase shift off. He's going to be able to get himself out of the orb. He's already been able to bring down the clock. But they might have to find Madara as well. They do! Dendi and Seneca, they bring down both of them. Now they'll turn back into the pit to finish off Roshan. There's no it looks like they want to be able to secure this bottom rune here. So Dendi walks on forward. Yeah, not the easy They've target. practiced this before. The battle <laughs> They're going to go for it regardless here. Dendi will then look to level up, but they have the spin right behind. They got that block wow. count that they're going to get the first blood. That is crazy. Miracles. But they've got two heroes back behind. Miracle on level five. KS is level four. Do they have any TPs that can come in? None on the Earthshaker. Nyx Assassin does have one available. Queen of Pain, those as well. That's a huge one. Yeah. Co-op definitely the TP that they're going to be looking for here if Nesky goes to the dive. The two players heals them. In oh. comes the dive, they go looking for it. The blood right is going to silence them up. It prevents any further initiation, but Kansas is already being brought down. Miracle is still fairly healthy. He's got 10 six charges. Hasn't been forced to pop him just yet. Goes for them now. Will be right click down. Chibix has already invested the point, so he's stuck here fighting. Just going to throw up a lot of attacks, but the heal comes in. It's the end dying. And it's an ult to come for the storm. Rampage for the storm. Seven minutes into the game. And that's nothing changed. Here we are. Vega ready to try and pull the upset here in game two. They drop game one. Want to walk away with a split. There's going to be an RP! Best RP in the game! Brings it back into the static storm, and the follow up is finally there for Nava. Oh my god, he got the second one! There's the corner! The Rapier is going in four dead! They want no one at home! They're going to find him, too! The Shadow beats down! And five heroes in through the age of They're looking to bring back down another time! They'll get him as a Jesus! Or the Dyer's charge, of middle tower. He's gonna break the smoke. BKB. Oh, Fisher's gonna start things off. Can they chase on him? Nope, he gets his ultimate off. The vacuum comes through. Well, they get the cleave. It's coming through. Everybody's dying. Oh my oh. god. Full stop coming to the high ground. Rear's still alive. Looking for a blink. Echo Slide potentially. Can you turn this one around? It looks like he's just gonna scurry away as the fight's been lost. Oh, Rain is poor. Lucky to keep Earthshaker alive. Potentially clean up. We'll see more and more spam eviscerating the creep wave. There will be a fissure on Balix. Death Ward going through the call down as well. Everything's all by some days. And now, the RP! They found them all! 4 ASC looking for the great massacre in the radiant side of the map. There is an echo trying to turn it. Counter Death Ward there as well. Four anchors running rough shot over Birdie United. Four dead. About to be five. It's a team wipe! London Conspiracy Vegas Squadron matchup if they can even hope for a tiebreaker situation, but uh oh, here we go. They charge on in, but they're caught all together. A huge cart is going to drop them right there. Funny looks to move on in. They get the pull back. The wall is going to be there, so they couldn't really capitalize too much on all the being together, but now they got the scream. They, they shot the huge damage. Oh no, Yellow Submarine. It is indeed going to be a sinking ship down to the bottom abyss. Do you think Juggernaut has gone for this max healing war build? The Snap Jump build is very lackluster. So cool down there as they go to the Roach Pit. Oh, Sam H. Sam H is going to get picked off. Wow. Yeah, okay. That's a sad way to die. But the same slot to die. Here comes the. Well, they're not going to jump in yet, but here's a spirit. Static Storm is. Come in, boy. I'm waiting for you with the Epi. But he actually snatched the Aegis. That's huge. He's going to come back alive. He, he's dropping low. He's going to go down without actually using his Omni Slash. Disruptor gets picked up in the air. The game could be over just from this one play.
Again, a blink back for Yor, baiting out the storm. KP has armor now, so he's ready to fight another two Yor Fissure. There's no chain stuns to follow this one up. They're gonna Crimson guard up and look to fight the death one at the back line from the Witch Doctor doing some good damage and being blocked largely. Great so way through QO. Oh, Still alive damage. for now, and Rave get blowing up. KP in the front lines with a BKB mask of madness. Tears apart. Rave is the buyback here. Oh, Blink and go slap Rio! Oh, Fissure as well! Holy oh, cow! Gosh. That fight was completely lost by Ray for real, completely turning it around. He has really been stepping it up when it mattered the most in this game, and now he's got a, a much easier time performing his tasks. Oh, task. oh, oh no, 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 high ground advantage for Navi! They're just gonna drop everything right on their head! It is absolute chaotic destruction for them! Unfortunate timing, Epi cleanup! Oh it's man! Over! The ship has Stop. sunk! Also, it hasn't really been that impactful in this it, game. It really hasn't, but oh now boy. maybe it could be. They got the Hex on Dread. They can bring down this Jakiro. He's been focusing them so much before. The Yule is Sector is there, him? but a Vorse is just sitting there. There goes Jakiro finally, but a Vorse will not give this up. The Shiva's Guard will slow him down. Turns on the BKB, but he's run to he's a as well as the Tombstone. They have to almost back up from this one, while the Dream Call holding four heroes from Na'Vi in place. The Ice Bar's on the way, but Na'Vi, they lose the Ancient Apparition. A Vorse is down for the count. Artis is so low. Funnick and Denny, they're trying to bring down that damn Urza, but another Shadow Grave is available! He's still alive and backing up! Nothing is lost of value from HR, and Na'Vi lose many things of value. A great play from the game. Actually, he's just gonna eat the- wait, who- they just gave the cheese to Arts and he just ate it, like, whatever, let's- let's go. It might be the right call, because they get a new one anyway. They could just go Roche now, and I don't yep. think Na'Vi wants to fight for Roshan's it. actually up, and they have the Aegis- they have the Aghanim set for upgrade on Dazzle. Seneko's in the neighborhood, and he steals the Invis rune. Do they, do they still have a gem? Does HR still have a gem? They have it on Puck. Okay, so watch Puck's position, because Seneko... He's pretty... Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. He could potentially steal this. If he's he gonna die, Puck will be here in time. If he could disrupt it. Well, there's if Puck comes in. Puck's on the way in, but he's got to get there now, and if Artis fires up... Oh, wait, maybe. Yeah, he's, he's actually in the lane. There. This is possible for Seneko. Stealing the Aegis might be big, but he can disrupt up Artis and slow this down. The dual threat is there, and he steals the Aegis the Immortal, oh, but he doesn't pop out of Invis by stealing God. it. He almost tried to pick up the cheese as well. Well, but he actually grabs a TP scroll and gets out. And hey, HR could be wondering what the hell just happened? Where is he? The puck's coming in having a look. They have no idea. This is the kind of place that can win a game. And you know what else? That's a support bounty hunter. Do you really want to drop sentries and focus that hard on a support hero? Not really. He might be able to grab, grab the courier. It's going to be very close. Will he be able to get it? He's trying. He's not close enough. That was so close. That would have been 165 gold to everybody on Mouse's team. The Courier again comes out, giving uh, them another chance. He saw that going back. What happened? Uh, did, he, did he have three pulled? Oh, 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 he's going back. <laughs> he is going to get the second Round chance. Round two, he's not going to get it. Have I might die? Or... What's the Courier doing? You would, uh, he actually might have been able to get it. He's Maybe that scared. was the better play. The Llama is going to sit underneath the tower. He's going to wait for this. They ping for it. They're like, oh, he's probably here. We haven't seen him in a while. Yeah, they know he's, he's gonna, around there. I like this going high ground. He's going to invis, and he's going to go back. It won't be spotted that way. Secret agent mission for the bounty hunter. Which way will it go? It's going to go all the way around top, this maybe. Is, this is so dangerous. It's going to go back through mid. He doesn't see it. Can he wrap around on time? We'll be able to get vision of it. There's, there's I, Dota action else happening elsewhere. Else but, oh, great. Now he's going for it. We're going to look away. Oh, he gets it. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs>